obviously take a loss in the first game at home. It's disappointing. But uh, at this point, right now, we got a game on Friday, and it's a it's an opportunity. It's a it's a it's a chance to bounce back and uh, get a win against a good team. So that's that's all we can focus on now. How hard was it making adjustments uh, on the fly today with all the you know issues and stuff you guys have had practicing five on five lately? Uh, that's no excuse. I mean, uh, we're, we're we're a new team. We we got out there. We played an older, experienced team, and uh, they they outplayed us today. We we didn't guard well enough. I didn't guard well enough, and um, we got to be better. And to beat Colorado on Friday, we, we're gonna have to be a lot better. And it did seem like you uh, played with a little bit more aggression than we've seen in previous years. Um, how did you feel like you played today? Uh, I didn't play. I mean, we lost, so <laughs> it's not. There's not no good or bad way to look at it. It's only to just learn from it. I mean, I made a lot of mistakes on defense. Some other stuff I could have done well on offense. So I got to improve. I got to get better, and I got to help my teammates improve too. All right. Thanks, Mike. Really appreciate it. Jackson. Hey, Mike. Uh, just when you've got such a new group of guys like that and you've had such little, you know, repetition when you're playing five on five what are you telling your your younger teammates trying to help them adjust and, and you know make different changes throughout the course of a game um it's a it's a little it's a little different throughout the course of the game uh because they're, they're sort of like when, when when you're here and you've been here for a long time you sort of understand stuff more like understand lingo like terminology and you could see things and try to talk things out. So, but like today, I mean, it was our first first time being out there, and um, all I could do is tell, try to help tell them play hard, play smart. Uh, yeah, that's that's about it. And, and then for you personally, stepping into a role where you're you're a leader and you're you're going to be asked to score more. How has your mindset changed when you're handling the ball and, and you've got a, kind of a different role than you have in the past? Uh, I mean, my mindset is still the same. I mean, whatever, whatever is the best option for our team to score, that's what's, uh, that's what we need to do. And um, uh, I, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what how to really answer that because, I mean, it's not about me scoring. It's not about anybody, one person scoring. It's about our team scoring. But we, more than anything, we got to play defense. So we got to play defense. Uh, Michael Goins. Yeah, Mike, do you feel like the, the offense is quite a bit ahead of where the defense is right now? Uh, uh, I, I'd say you could, you could say that, yeah. But uh, even on offense, we still weren't good enough. I mean, defense, we definitely weren't good enough. But on offense, we could have been better. Uh, could have made it got easier easier baskets at certain times. But uh, just defensively, we really, we really got to, we got really got to learn, learn from this game, watch the film and pick it up and be ready to play on Friday. Have you felt like the, the young guys have taken a little bit to, to grasp some off, uh, defensive concepts? Um, I, I just think that they haven't had the experience to, to learn from it and uh, play other teams, other people, other styles. I mean, this is their first for a lot of them. That this was their first time playing college basketball and uh, a, a real game and against other people with a, with different styles. Like you know, so they're gonna they're gonna get better as time goes on. All we could do is try to improve. Appreciate it, Mike. Uh, Grant. Hey, Mike. What's your evaluation of uh, how Nigel Pack and Celta Miguel played today? Um, I mean, they they both came on the court and they they played hard. Uh, they, uh, you know, it's 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 tough for freshmen to just come in like this without any scrimmages and play an experienced team like this. But they 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 came in, they played hard, and um, they're both two players that are just going to keep getting better. Just got to keep working. What is it about Nigel that you know it seemed like he was poised and was a able to knock down those shots offensively 
Um, is he going to be able to be that point guard for you guys for this team this year? Um, I mean, he yeah, he obviously you see him, you see he has a bunch of a bunch of ability. He he could be a really good player uh, now and in the future, and uh, he's going to keep getting better. But we 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 really just need to come together as a team. It's not it's not about one one player because defense is a te- is a team is all about team. It's not about one player on defense. So once we we need to get some defensive chemistries, togetherness on defense, and and that's where that's where we'll improve.